Those who know what the VW bus are, you typically will get the peace sign, the thumbs up, the wave, something of that nature saying, hey, I really like your bus. Bought it back probably around 1991, 92. And the reason I purchased it at that time, I had two kids at the time, probably about eight years old and five, and they wanted to camp. Well, naturally, the Westphalia bus is a perfect camper. So I picked it up at that time and we started camping in it. You have to reach in to open the door. It doesn't open from out there, but you know, 44 years. Uh, the bus over the years has gone through a number of paint jobs, depending on how quickly it fades. This one in particular, we have a friend of the family who happens to be an artist slash zip line operator. And he stopped by the house one night and we were talking about the artwork he does. And I said, hey, Steven, how would you like a big canvas like a VW bus? And uh, he jumped on it. So he, he painted it for me. Uh, well, it's a four cylinder horizontal engine. Uh, 1600 cc's, which is a 1.6 liter. It's four speed in forward, one in reverse. Uh, gets about zero to 60 miles in about five minutes, something of that nature. Does it have air conditioning? It does. You roll the two front windows down and you open the little vents and you go 40 miles an hour and it's called 440 air conditioning. Being a 70 bus, it always has that hippie thought to it when people think of it. So we were thinking about that and we thought, well, what personifies the 60s and 70s? Rock and roll music is one of those. And so some of the bands of that era, such as Zeppelin, Hendrix, Joplin, things of that, are what we started to lean toward. Uh, in fact, I'd have to say the first album I ever bought when I was probably in seventh grade was the Led Zeppelin album. And dad promptly told me, if I can hear that from the living room, it's too loud. Uh, there's something about owning a VW bus. It's like owning an old VW bus. And I can't explain it, I can't put a finger on it, but if you get bit by that bug, so to speak, then it's just, once again, it brings smiles to people's faces, and I don't know why, it just does. <laughs>